The security environment in the Asia-Pacific is quickly changing, bringing with it increased instability. According to the Japanese Ministry of Defense, the number of foreign aircraft violating the country's airspace has increased 300% in the last three years. In 2013 alone, more than 800 incidents required the Air Self-Defense Force to scramble aircraft as a safety measure against potential threats. As the Japanese government works to maintain its sovereignty, the country needs to ensure its defense force can detect threats and take immediate action. Intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities are the first line of defense and vital to maintaining constant awareness. Faced with growing threats, aircraft need to patrol large areas for much longer periods of time, and foreign targets need to be detected from farther away. By utilizing a set of systems instead of a single asset, defense forces can quickly gather the information they need to make decisions affecting their nation's safety. One way to achieve this is through the use of systems such as the manned E-2D Advanced Hawkeye F-35 Joint Strike Fighter, and unmanned aircraft including the Global Hawk and Fire Scout. The E-2D Advanced Hawkeye, strengthened by 30 years of Japanese experience with the E-2C Hawkeye, provides critical airborne early warning capabilities. As the newest E-2 variant, the E-2D features a state-of-the-art radar that provides 360-degree coverage in any type of weather. When combined with the aircraft's numerous other upgrades, such as modernized communications, the E-2D significantly enhances awareness, early warning, and mission control capabilities over land and sea. The Global Hawk unmanned aircraft can fly for up to 28 hours in a single mission and at heights of up to 60,000 feet. This allows uninterrupted intelligence and surveillance of vast geographic regions without putting anyone in harm's way. These systems can also be used for vital support during natural disasters and rescue operations. The E-2 played a significant role in the 2013 disaster relief efforts following Typhoon Haiyan in the Philippines. When the typhoon destroyed all ground-based operations, E-2 air crews immediately stepped in as the air traffic control element. In 2011, Global Hawk was used to take high-resolution imagery following the Great East Japan earthquake, allowing responders to identify damaged roads and bridges. The aircraft was also flown over the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant to help Japanese officials understand the extent of facility damage. Times are changing, and with them, the need to protect against growing threats, both known and unknown. Only the right mix of aircraft systems can provide Japan with the intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities vital to assuring peace and prosperity for years to come.